Hello farming family, welcome to Olipas Farms. I always say there's money in the soil and you always need to get your hands dirty. Today we are on etting up. Watch out. I want to show you how to do etting up. Very simple. When we talk about etting up, what is etting up? You know, it's an act. It's an act. You know, it's an act of heaping the soil around the plant to hold the stem base of the plant. So watch out. Let me show you practically on how to do etting up. Etting up helps increase the crop yield it protect the frog the crop from being falling when a heavy rain a he, heavy either rain, heavy rain or a heavy wind blows it doesn't allow the crop to fall down so you could see this video will tell you the difference between the etting up crops the crops that we have done the etting up and the one that we haven't the differences so watch out and then you will love this the etting up help improves the the plants yield because it helps to conserve moisture content around the soil, uh, around the crop. So watch out. Let's, so this is how you're going to start the etting up. Here is the access route. The in between the plant, between the plants, here is the access route. This is within plant. This is between plant. So within the access route, or within uh, between the plant, what you're going to do is you fetch the soil inside the access road so you fetch the soil like this you lift it up then you place it under the root of the plant you fetch the soil like this you place it under the root of the plant once you are doing that the soil helps hold the the, the stem base of the plant so once you heap the soil here it hold the plant like this so once it the heavy a heavy rain blows it doesn't allow the plant to fall down neither the the fruit even touches the ground so it gives you a neat fruit as compared to the ones that we haven't done the etting up let's go here let me show you something here this place we haven't done the etting up yet so as you could see the the, the fruit is touching the ground so it makes the fruit become very dirty once it rains. The soil touches the fruit. So this etting up and you can see the, 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 the plant has burned. The, the plant has burned. Without the, the etting up. But once you do the etting up, it makes the plant become stiff and straight like this. It doesn't allow when the wind blows, it falls down like that. No, it doesn't allow that. The, the, the soil holds it. So that is why we are talking about the etting up. It helps the plant. It helps the plant prolong the plant life and then also increase the crop yield. Because once you it holds the stem base of the plant, an extra or another root shoot out from the stem base of the plant to hold the soil around it. Whereby it also tap another nutrient from the soil to work. So watch out. So this etting up, as I'm say, I'm, I'm showing you. This is how you're gonna do it. You do your legs like this. One leg inside the within between the uh, the access road, one leg to between the other access road. So you fetch, you place your hole, you fetch the soil like this, you place it here within. Once you fetch it around the plant, you also fetch it within the plant. So you fetch it like this, like this, like this, like that. So this is the first side of the earth now. Then you turn to the other side. You turn to the other side like this. Once you are done with the first side, the first right side, you turn to the left side. So you go like this. You fetch like this. You place it here. You fetch like this. You place it here. You fetch like this. You place it here. Like this. Like that. You see. So once you come, you could see that. Come closer. You could see that the soil is holding the stem base of the plant. So it, that it will not allow a rain to make it fall down, neither rainfall. So it is straight like that. Like this. You see? Yes, it will not fall down. Thank you for watching. Keep watching. We have the best things for you and you will love it. We are out.